Planned Parenthood and other pro-abortion groups recently released a blueprint for a so-called feminist foreign policy. That is this week's Speak Out segment. This pro-abortion strategy is called Toward a Feminist Foreign Policy in the United States. It was released by more than 50 groups, including Planned Parenthood, NARAL, and Population Institute. This plan calls for the use of federal funds for abortion overseas, including a repeal of the expanded Mexico City policy and the Helms Amendment, which would then allow for the use of federal funds for abortion as a family planning method. The document defines a feminist foreign policy as, quote, the policy of a state that defines its interactions with other states as well as movements and other non-state actors in a manner that prioritizes peace, gender equality, and environmental integrity, enshrines, promotes, and protects the human rights of all, seeks to disrupt colonial, racist, patriarchal, and male-dominated power structures, and allocates significant resources, including research, to achieve that vision. Reading through this foreign policy plan, I cannot help but remember the words of one of our greatest human rights advocates in modern times, St. Teresa of Calcutta. Mother Teresa once said, the greatest destroyer of peace today is abortion. A foreign policy plan that puts abortion at the center of its agenda will not bring about peace, only destruction. It's not surprising Planned Parenthood would try to push their abortion agenda overseas, but Planned Parenthood is not in the foreign policy business. It is in the abortion business. So, of course, their foreign policy does not actually protect the human rights of all. 